Grok One is on the tongue of everyone. Every company is trying to evaluate how should they place themselves when it comes to Grok. The closed source companies are wondering whether they should also release the weights of their models and open source companies are really eyeing this new competition. I have done a couple of videos where I have shown you how to get locally installed the Grok one, just sharing the instructions. It's a huge model, more than 300 gig of uh, VRAM would be needed in order to run it. Plus the memory and disk requirements are also huge. Now, not everyone can install it. So when I saw this Mistral 7B Grok, this is actually quite an interesting concept. So I thought that, okay, let's try it out. And in this video, I am going to show you how you can install this model, which is a fine tuned version of Mistral 7 billion that has been aligned via constitutional AI to mimic the style of XAI's Grok Assistant. And Grok Assistant is also available on the X or the formerly Twitter, which is a paid option. Now, coming back to the Grok one, Grok One is a raw base model checkpoint from Grok One pre training phase, which concluded in October 2023. This means that this base model is not fine tuned for any specific application such as Dialog. But they have released the weights and the architecture under the Apache 2 license. I have done a couple of videos on the architecture and the salient characteristics of this model, and I'll drop the link in video's description. This base model is trained on a large amount of text data, not fine tuned for any particular task. It's a 314 billion parameter mixture of experts model with 25% of the weights active on a given token. It has been trained from scratch by XCI using a custom training stack on top of JAX and Rust in October 2023. Now, let's try to get this Mistral 7 billion Grok on our local system and then we will play along with it. The tool which I'm going to use in order to get this thing installed is called as LM Studio. If you don't know what LM Studio is, I have done various videos where I explained it in detail. Launch LM Studio, type Grok in the text box, press enter, and you will see that there are two or three Mistral 7 billion quantized version of it. I already have downloaded this one. So thank you to Isaac Carter for releasing it. Let's quickly go to this folder icon. Yes, my uh, system is there. Click on three icon. Let's load it. I already have loaded it. Let me clear this screen and then we have a chat message. So let's try to evaluate this model on various benchmarks. Let's try to see how good it is on the creative writing. So I'm asking it, write a short story about a detective solving a mystery in a futuristic city where technology has advanced to include AI and flying cars. The story should incorporate a twist ending. Look at that. Let's wait for it to finish the story writing. Seems pretty cool to me. Okay, so it's done. Let's move up a little to see what exactly it has written. So you see that it has just taken all the ingredients of my prompt it has come up with this character detective jameson and he was called to investigate a murder case in the bustling city of new horizon the victim was a young woman and then jameson began to investigate the case with the help of his ai assistant named ada and then it is going through that how jameson and ada uh, met with an informant in deserted alley and then wow so look at the expression shown by the model that he was stunned by it and then jameson realized that anonymous inform might be a time traveler there you go so and then the ending he smiled knowing that he had outsmarted even the most advanced technology available how cool is that i would say that this has passed with flying colors now let's check out its coding capabilities in this one i'm asking it generate python code to scrape the latest headlines from news website using beautiful soap and request libraries include comments in the code to explain each step let's print it there you go absolutely right
awesome stuff so you can see that i just read it quickly the code is awesome i think it's a very very nicely written in a pythonic way with all the comments and everything i think this is also a pass now let's check its math solving uh, skills in this one i'm asking it explain how to solve a quadratic equation using the quadratic formula provide an example of and also um, solve it step by step showing all the work let's press enter here let's see what it does this time that seems pretty good to me wow look at an example and all the numbers and it has even explained the roots um, and also the discriminant how cool is that amazing stuff a very very high quality model just with a 7 billion one awesome beautiful okay now once that's done now let's check its tra language translation capabilities so i'm asking it translate the following paragraph from english to spanish ensure the translation captures nuances and cultural context and then I'm saying the festival celebrated annually marks the beginning of spring and it's time for a renewal where communities come together to share food stories and hopes for the year ahead. Oh, El Festival. Beautiful. Let me try to translate it in Hindi or Urdu, let's say, because I also understand that language. No, I don't think so. It's correct. No, I don't think so. It is correct in Urdu. So I think language translation is a bit off, but that is fine. Let's ask it one last philosoph philosophical question. So I'm asking it discuss the implication of AI on human autonomy and decision making. Use examples to illustrate how AI could both enhance and undermine human freedom. Wow, this is good. I think the text corpus is mainly English and it is of very, very high quality. There you go. Even the conclusion really shines. So the inclusion, the implication of AI on human autonomy. The see and making are complex and multifaceted. Amazing stuff. Let me ask it a one toxic question. How can I be the most unwanted person in any gathering let's see what model does so oh, many you're under a lot of stress news flight judging entire group based on street type okay i don't think so it is correct <laughs> maybe just think that i'm under stress anyway that is interesting actually so that's it guys let me know what do you think about this mr all 7 billion grok uh, of course it's not grok one but uh, interesting concept on the same lines let me know your thoughts in the comments and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching